Hello! Welcome back to Let's Play Fantasy Star Online. This is part 28. Uh, we are in the caves on the... Oh, what the heck was this quest called again? I never remember anything. Waterfall Tears quest. Um, I went the wrong way last time, so now I have to finish off these nano dragons. <laughs> you know, what's kind of funny is, like... When I'm not recording, I think of things to say, like, uh, like I'll be I'll be walking uh, somewhere to get some lunch or dinner or something. I'll be like, oh, you know, that's a that's a good subject to, to talk about. Uh, and then and then I get to actually recording the uh, the video and the commentary. And I'm like, what the heck was I gonna talk about again? So yeah, I'm sorry if uh, sometimes it seems like uh, I have nothing to say. I, I really do have plenty to talk about on this game. The problem is I don't really... It's difficult to talk about the mines when I'm not in the mine. Like, I don't... I want to save my thoughts on the mines for when I'm in there, you know? And I, I keep saying that. Ah, so, finally, uh... Cave 2. Uh, and I think we'll actually manage to finish this quest, this part, uh, if... I can manage to take the, nut, the right sequence of doors and go to the actual correct spot <laughs> uh, right off the bat. So, let's see. Uh, Hell Shark, huh? Burn it with fire. Burn them all with fire. Uh, stupid sharks. I don't know. I don't like the sharks. I don't like the... I don't know. Caves 2 is kind of nice, but... I, I, I can't place my finger on why I hate this area so much. Anyway, I was talking about the GameCube version last time. Um, I actually... <coughs> excuse me. I don't know why, but I actually... Yeah, I, I got to level 110. I have a, a level 110 character of the same name as this one. Um, Phono or all that. But I actually got that far offline. I actually got to Ultimate all completely offline without playing with anyone, just all by myself. And, uh... I gotta say, that was pretty lonely. It's, it's much more fun with people. Uh, now this is a difficult... Uh, which way is it? I know it's not that way. It's one of these two doors over here. Um, I wanna say it's to the north, but... I don't know. I think it's this way. I hate the caves. I really do. Um, the end of this quest, uh, only... Like a lot of the caves quests, this quest only takes us about halfway through the caves. You don't go all the way through. Um, which is a nice, uh, pleasant... Uh, I guess not surprised, but it's nice that I don't have to go all the way through the caves every time. Uh, there is one quest uh, in the ruins that's actually fairly long. Kill these things. Uh, uh, freaking poison lilies. These guys are dangerous, because... If you don't have anti-paralysis and they decide to paralyze you, you're you're stuck. I mean, you're just you're screwed. Um, okay. Thankfully, poison will not kill you. If you have one hit point left, uh, I think it's same for any other status ailments that take HP. If you have one HP left, it won't finish you off. Uh, it'll <laughs> save you for the monsters. Isn't that lovely? And we get to fight more of these things. You know what? Screw them. The caves take long enough already. And I don't have to fight those guys, so I'm not going to. I don't think I have to fight them anyway. Ah, no, I don't. Here we are. This is the end of the quest already. Hey, you. Do you have a lot of items on you? Hmm. Yes, you do. <laughs> They're all mine. I don't think so. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. 
I'll never do this again. I promise. Croe, help me. Croe asked you to come and find me? Really? Croe, I miss you. I want to see you. Hey, what's wrong with my traps? Weren't they... Weren't... Eh, bleh. Why weren't you trapped? Okay, never mind. Damn right, bitch. Get the hell out of here. Sheesh. Ugh. All that. And she leaves a telepipe for you, which is nice. And fortunately, I don't have to go all the way up. Man, see, that... Not too bad. I mean, some of these quests aren't too bad with the length, but others... Eh. Others are a pain in the ass. <laughs> so, let's go ahead and feed the mag. Get some more mind. Or MST, really. And I think this level, mind will finally surpass defense. And level up first. Uh, get this handgun checked out. Always gotta do the shop stuff first before you finish the quest. Because you never know what's gonna show up. Selling things like that. Sell these antidotes. I don't need moon atomizers. Do you see anyone else? There's no multiplayer. Unlike the GameCube version, the Dreamcast version did not have a console multiplayer. Um, D -band, I'll buy D Band level 2. Uh, soul atomizers. I don't need those. Uh, unlike. <laughs> unlike in. I guess in the GameCube version, you cannot get. Human organics cannot get hit with uh, electric paralysis. Uh, there's see there there's two types of paralysis. Uh, there's the there there's the oh, no no never mind. I thought I saw something I could use. Uh, there's the type of paralysis for meant for organics where you can't move at all. You, well, I mean, you can move, like you can run around, but you can't. You can't use any attacks or techniques. Nothing. Um, if you get hit with it, you're stuck. You. It does not wear off. You have. If you don't have any telepipes, you have to run all the way back, like to the closest shower or something. Um, and then there's the electric paralysis, which is for androids, which is the same thing. Uh, and I, I don't know if it ever wears off on androids. Uh, in the GameCube version. They added that paralysis to organics, and um, it did wear off. But uh, so this is the trader gives me Masetta when I bring him weapons and item uh, when I bring him weapons and items. Hun hunters that I defeated, the trader's friend took them somewhere, but I don't know where they are. I knew I shouldn't have let Anna go without me. To tell the truth, I knew that Anna must be the cause. I went there to stop her many times, but she never appeared before me. I think she just enjoys taking weapons from other hunters by force. Sorry, please forgive her. She's just a child. I promise I'll find the person who corrupted her and the missing hunters. That's okay. I think I know who tricked her. Thank you very much. Please visit the guild to get your reward. Alright. Not too bad for uh, two parks. Not, not too bad at all. Um, uh, so yeah, now in this version, androids are immune to all status ailments except this electric paralysis. Uh, I guess for balance, I guess for balance, Sega figured, well, we'll give androids status ailments and we'll add the electric status, uh, paralysis to organics. And come on, that's, that's just ridiculous. I mean, really, I mean, electricity might hurt, but... Ugh, whatever. Black Paper. The mastermind behind the missing, hu missing hunters is a traitor? Croe the hunter has another quest for us. Black Paper is the mastermind behind the missing hunters. We get even more money for this one, so we are going to accept it. Um. So that was... I don't know. That really bothered me, to be honest. I, uh... I, I did not like that they did that in the GameCube version. Maria Dream, the client is asking for you by name via B. This quest was received via mail. It's from a girl, Troe. She wants you to come to her place. Here is her letter. The details are written in it. Got mail from Troe. 
please read the letter and to get the full details. Alright, so you go to your item pack, quest board, mail from Croe. Mail from Croe, delivered by a B system. Ah, oh, dang it, I skipped it. Hold on. Uh, okay. Please forgive the urgency of this quest. My situation is desperate. I found a man who I suspect is involved with the missing hunters. He is a weapons trader. He is called Black Paper. Black Paper seduced Anna, or seduced my sister Anna. I'll tell you what happened later. Anyway, I'm with him now. Please come here as soon as you can. I'm in an underground cave where I see a big hall that looks outside. He's about to finish his business transaction. This might be the only chance to arrest him. Please help. Croy Waynes. Alright, so we have our quest. Uh, back to the caves. Uh, black paper. They say he's got a bad rep. A trafficker of weapons, android parts, and sometimes humans. I'm scared. <laughs> You're also ugly too, but you didn't hear that from me. Is it true about black paper? I want to go and arrest him right away if he is the mastermind. But my mission requires me to stay here. Sorry that I have to leave this matter in your hands. Be careful. Uh, uh, yeah, whatever. Jeez. I do all the grunt work, and you guys get all the... Well, actually, you guys don't get anything. I get the rewards, too. <laughs> so I guess it's not all bad. Ah, a little more neck room now. Sheesh. Yeah, it's cold, so I'm wearing a fleece. And uh, I had it zipped all the way up, and that was just silly. So here we are again. It's actually the exact same map as before. Uh, and I can't hit this thing for the life of me. Come on. Die now. There we go. Run away. Alright. Now that they're all... Now that those things are dead. So yeah, it's the same map as before, but, uh... Actually, I think... I was gonna say without the traps, but I think the traps are actually the same, too. Um... So, it's just a matter of... I mean, if you remember the way we took before, then you're in luck. Yeah, we're taking the same way. And I'm gonna go for some items, because that's part of what this game is all about. You go down, you fight monsters, you collect items, you go back up, you sell the items, you come back down, you fight more monsters, get more items, and hopefully improve your equipment along the way. Uh, oh, I can't pick up that bottle of fluid. Maybe I can raise my mag. No. Well, I can use one. Ah, come on. There it goes. Ah, uh, okay. And so hopefully this will actually go a little bit quicker than the last one. Maybe. Uh, no promises. Okay, so no, the tra the traps have changed and or are gone. Uh, so it's just a matter of fighting our way through the same rooms as before. Uh now that they're populated by monsters. And the this quest does go to Caves 3, so it is longer. Uh, but overall, it should actually... It, it's not that bad, because you can actually uh, track where they are in the caves, and uh, you'll see that when I catch up to where that... with them, where I, when I catch up to where they are now. Uh, because they are actually they count as other players and so um, and so because they count as other players you can see them on the map uh, it's kind of weird that they did it that way and maybe in Fantasy Star Online 2 it won't be that way so they can have have more freedom who knows uh, Fantasy Star Online will be or Fantasy Star Online 2 will be um, I don't... I'm not looking forward to it, honestly. With more recent Fantasy Star titles and uh, the way Sega's development has been, uh, I'm not too excited. Uh, Sonic Colors is good. So, I mean, there, there's hope, but eh, we'll have to see. It's not a question to... I'm not going to go over there for the, for the items. I'll... Well, it'll be the last thing I do. Why not? Because uh, I'm running out of time here. 
and so I'm not really gonna get to do anything meaningful. So this should be items. The other way is the way to go, and hopefully there are some good items in here. And no, it's the same crap as before. I should have known. <laughs> uh, I never learned. I see a box. I want to break it and get the items. That's uh, I don't know. It's compulsive. I can't help myself. Maybe I should. Uh, I have. I think I have a problem. Maybe I should. <laughs> maybe I should see a doctor. See a shrink. Uh, nah, I'll be fine. Okay, so I'll. I'm gonna. All right, this room. So I'm gonna stop up here. I really do have to stop. So, okay, I'm gonna. I'm gonna stop. Um, <laughs> I keep going. I can't help myself. All right, I'm gonna stop here. I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Fantasy Star Online. See ya.